She must be a yogi. I'm going to fall. Okay. Get whiplash putting these bracelets on. She's looking like, I can't be bothered. <laughs> you guys welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel if you're new here today I'm gonna to do a video that I've been wanting to make for a while which is recreating outfits that I love from my Pinterest board so if y'all have like not checked out Pinterest in a while you are seriously missing out I feel like Pinterest is just a mecca of I know it's what Instagram used to be it's photos of outfit inspiration and it kind of just sparks my love of things that I already have in my closet um, and I love looking at it for inspiration and then kind of using it. It kind of goes in the back of my brain and then I use it when I get dressed when I'm trying to create a fun new outfit. But today I actually wanted to style four that were already on my Pinterest recreate folder that I recently started. And I'm super excited. I love making fashion content videos. I love kind of pushing myself to use what I currently have in my closet to get creative. It doesn't have to be an exact match. So let's take that mentality of like, it has to be the same color jean or the same brand or anything like that. And just kind of use what we have in our closet to create pieces that really inspire us to fall in love with what we already have. I absolutely love this. So I'm super excited. I was able to create these four outfits like that like I just went to my closet do, 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 threw it on this rack and I'm so excited none of them are exact pieces not one single one but I still think it's gonna be a lot of fun to kind of build these outfits with you and kind of talk through them so if you like seeing the style of video please let me know by giving this video a thumbs up letting me know in the comments down below what your favorite outfit was and if you're not following me on Pinterest now already go ahead follow me it's in the description box down below I love it I need to post more but Without further ado, let's go ahead and get into today's video, which is recreating four of my favorite Pinterest outfits. All right, so outfit number one is this guy right here. This is what I'm going to try to recreate from my own closet, and I think it's going to be pretty simple. Let's just be real. You guys know I love a good shoulder sweater thing, and I felt like I needed to show you that other people enjoy it as well, because two of my outfits would have it, but I am obsessed with it. But I decided to pull two different trench coats and see which one I like better. I think that's the beauty of recreating, is taking inspiration and not being like a carbon copy. I love that idea. So. I've got two different trench coats that I want to try based off of the length of them. This darker one's a little bit longer and then this one's a little bit shorter. So we're going to see which one I like a little bit better. So let's go ahead and change into it. Okay, so we've got the base going. We've got the darker jeans. I never wear these from H&M and they're so cute. Um, they're a little tighter than I remember, but they're so cute. And then a basic white tee. This is also a recent buy from H&M and I love it so let's see what let's go with the light to start with and see what I think about it um this is from Strata, Stradivarius got it at um got it when I lived in Japan like a million years ago the only hesitation on this guy is I just don't feel like it's super long but I still think it gets the job done totally should have seen it okay so we've got this going let's go to shoes shoes i'm gonna pair are my vejas i think these are cute for spring this is such a spring with the trench coat so let's pop these guys on okay it's coming together she had like a fun layered necklace look so i'm going to take this one pop it on to add some gold detailing um and a little bit of pizzazz to the outfit you know to be honest with you this is out of my comfort zone because i never wear like layered necklaces over the top of like a T because I kind of feel like the rock. <laughs> We're gonna stick to the plan. Trust the process. Got a black little purse. She throws this over, which I'm totally a fan of. And then the piece de resistance. And she does this thing where she's like, this. <laughs> I don't know why, but she does a little bit of this. <laughs> Wait, does she really? How'd she get her leg up there? She must be a yogi. I need some more stretch. You channel her. Wait, I don't. What does she do with her arm? I'm gonna fall. Okay. I think it was a win. I'm kind of feeling it. 
Okay, outfit number two we have right here. I picked this one for a couple different reasons. First, my love affair with graphic tees, jeans, and Converse runs so deep in me, it's like not even funny. But there are also two things in this outfit that I never, that I own that I never gravitate towards or style that much. So I wanted to kind of push myself to do so. First one being light jeans. I just don't really gravitate towards them a ton. And I don't know, I just don't find myself wearing them and reaching for them. So that's where I decided to kind of pull the trigger and challenge myself with that. And also I like the idea of the, like the idea of a light tee with a light wash jean and then bold, dark, accessories and that's a fun way to bring an outfit into the spring as well and then second I just find myself not styling my black blazer enough so it's so versatile it's so easy it's chic it's cool so we're gonna do it and it pairs well with the converse like the black converse so that's outfit number two let's put it together let's see my thoughts see how I feel let's do it okay base layer on light denim light graphic tee converse and then black blazer i feel like this is a look i love it how do we do how do we do i have to take these sunglasses off because i can't can't, can't um talk to a camera when it's like dark so I love this. I actually really like the light graphic tee with the light jeans. Her jeans are a little bit longer, so they cover kind of the ankle. <sighs> I tried pulling mine down, they won't stay, but still so cute. All right, outfit number three. I picked this for two reasons as well. I recently got these like dark gray, black jeans, as you will. Not recently, I got them this past year. And I love them, I knew I wanted them because I was missing them for my wardrobe, but again, they're just, I always find myself reaching for medium jeans. That's pretty much it. Um, so I was like, yes, when I saw this style, I was like, yes, because first of all, this is like my most worn, but you all know my button ups. You can't really see the front of her, but I feel like this is what it would look like. So my inspiration, obsessed, think this is gonna look really cute. And again, with the black Converse, this is what I mean with it doesn't have to be exact. Hers are more crop jeans. I'm gonna wear long. You can cuff them, whatever you want. It doesn't have to be perfect. You don't have to buy the exact items for every single outfit to recreate these outfits. So that's kind of what I'm trying to drive home. So let's go ahead and put that outfit together. So I can't really tell how many buttons she has because she's face backwards. So we're just gonna kind of do what I would do. This is like one of my all time favorite shirts from Everlane. I need to browser side again but um I love the boxiness of it it's like perfectly structured I've been loving bracelets again just wish I put them on in a normal way it's like get whiplash putting these bracelets on okay she's looking like I can't be bothered <laughs> Can I nail it I don't know, I'm kind of here for this. I like the super like dramatic contrast between the, you know, light blue, nice and, I don't know, fun. Um, dark jeans and Converse. Can we see it trend? I love Converse. Okay, the fourth outfit I left for last because it, is, because it is totally a Kelly outfit. I will say I've never styled sneakers with this. I wouldn't choose to style like, not sneakers. I, of course I would choose to style sneakers because I live in sneakers, but like athletic-y looking sneakers. So pairing Nikes with this outfit, I was kind of like, I like that. I want to try that. So classic white button up. Yes. I already had a green sweater. Yes. Baseball hat. I feel like that ties in with the sportiness of the shoes. It's everything. So yes, I love this outfit. It's totally me. Let's see if I love it all put together. Like the, the clothes itself are total me, but the hat and the shoes, let's see what I think about it. Let's go ahead and try it on. All right. So a couple things. She does a full down, but cuff. So buttoned, which I never do. I normally do like a, like a cuff, like a roll cuff. <laughs> um, so let's try that out. Nike sneaks, these definitely aren't the same, but I think they'll give the same sort of vibe. I think this gives like carefree, but like sporty mixed with super classic. I love it. She does a full tuck around. I don't know if she tucks the back. 
and I will leave the links to the direct girls that I got inspiration from to give them credit because these are not my outfits. Now, green sweater. My favorite purchase, like, ever. Something about green and white together, it just checks all my boxes. No, I don't live in LA. No, I've never lived in LA. And I don't watch the Dodgers. <laughs> I'm kind of living for the casual yet. Like, this looks I'm, like I'm busy. Like, she's on her phone, like, she's busy. She's got things to do. I'm living for it. So. All right, you guys, so I hope you guys enjoyed this. I had so much fun just kind of diving back into my closet and reminding myself that fashion gets to be fun. It doesn't have to be about just buying what's new and cool and this and that and having the exact same jeans as so-and-so. It has to be, or it gets to be fun. It gets to be creative. It gets to be exactly what you want with the pieces that work for you the best. So I'm so happy that I decided to do this video. I want to make them regular. That is if you guys really like them. So make sure you leave a comment down below. Do you like this style of video? Do you want to see more? Make sure you follow me on Pinterest and don't forget to tell me what outfit was your favorite. I love you guys and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!